how much work would I have to do to lift my roller skate with brick on it from the surface of the desk to the top of my box? Well, the distance that we're moving through can be measured then with a meter stick and the height of the height here is approximately 30 centimeters or decimal three meters. So the amount of work that I do in lifting it up from the surface to the top is then 0.3 meters for the distance and a force of 30 newtons. And when we do the calculations, the work then is going to be 30 newtons times 0 0.3 meters, which is then 9 newton meters or 9 joules. So that's the amount of work I would have to do to lift the object up directly. Now, let's see if we can build a ramp to do the same thing. And I've got a long shelf here, and I've cut a slit in the side of my box so that I can push the shelf into it, and then I can pull the cart up the ramp using my spring scale to measure the force again. I'll place the cart on the ramp and then I'll pull it with the spring scale and my force required is about 9 newtons. We'll just help it up to the top. So the force required to pull the cart up the ramp is about 9 newtons. The distance that I'm pulling it, we'll measure with a meter stick, is about 1.2 meters. So let's calculate the amount of work that I've done in pulling the cart up the ramp and onto the platform. So the force is 9 newtons approximately times 1.2 meters length along the ramp and it gives me a value of 10.8 newton meters or 10.8 joules. So the amount of work that I did in pulling the cart up the ramp and onto the platform is that just over 10 joules, the amount of work that it took me to lift it up directly from here up to here is then 9 joules. And so I'm actually having to do some extra work, but the advantage is that the force that I need to pull it up is actually less. To lift it up directly, I need to exert a force of 30 newtons. To pull it up the ramp, I exert a force of only 9 newtons. And so the amount of work that I did is more by pulling it up the ramp because I also have to overcome friction. Whereas when I lift it up directly, there's no friction to worry about, but I have to exert a greater force. And so we have then a simple machine, a ramp, which can reduce the amount of force that it takes to do uh, a certain amount of work, but I have to exert it over a longer distance and so actually do slightly more work by, lift, uh, by pulling it up a ramp than by lifting it up directly.